She see money all around me I look like I'm the man Yeah, but I was down and out like Hey guys, welcome week. back to my channel So, I know I had got a comment asking like How to pretty much do this hair Like how to maintain it um, so I wanted to show you guys how I maintain my VIP beauty hair. This is, I believe, um, Lord, I forgot, but it, I know it was like the deep curl, deep curly hair. I'll put the name somewhere like right here. But anyways, I, I literally just put this on my head and I want to show you guys how I maintain this hair and I want to give you my final review on it. Put it on my edges before I do my hair, mostly before I put my wigs on, just to keep my edges pretty thick. Once I have that settled, then I'll just pin everything down. I just make sure that the hair is pretty much um, lined the way it's supposed to be, like I've already done. So it should start to look like this. What I usually do is take my water and spray it. And this water has a bit of conditioner in it already, but I kind of took, like I, um, it just has little specks of this conditioner, but I'll probably put some more. This um, conditioner really keeps the hair moisturized and keeps the curls popping, okay? Sorry y'all hear all that work, um, that noise. They're working outside, so. I really love the wet and wavy look, so this is why I feel like with this conditioner, it keeps that hydrated look with the hair, it really does. I literally do this and then continue just going down the hair. So that's really all I do. And I don't really comb this hair out just because I just like make basically manipulate it with my fingers and I just continue to go down until I finish the rest. If y'all don't want to use as much product, what you can do, like how I was telling you guys, I had a little bit of the conditioner in the spray bottle. Just put it like as much as you think you're going to use in the spray bottle and then make it go by really quick and you won't have to do as much. As you can see, the inside is like hella matted. Like, ugh, it's like matted and stuff. So, I just kind of separate it with my fingers, wet it, and then put conditioner on it, and then continue to do that. And do I get shedding? Yes, I do. And I'll take some of my Eco Styler, and I just run it through the hair. And this is pretty much like the last thing that I do. I don't put too, too much because I don't want that hard crunch with the hair, but this is just basically part of the process. And it's starting to look like super, super juicy. I love juicy curls, y'all. All right, and pretty much that's it. Oh, I do go back in just one more time just to kind of, if my edges kind of just started getting wet and messing up. And that's it, you guys. Okay, you guys, so I've done the hair and now I just let it dry. I just go about my business, but I want to do a review on the hair, let you get a final review and let you guys know how this hair worked out for me, um, just everything about it. So for starters, I just want to say that the hair is, it was really beautiful the first day. Um, it still really is, as you can see, the hair is really pretty, but I personally feel like this hair I don't, I don't comb it out or anything like that for a reason, just because it's too tangly. Well, the first day, obviously first day hair, you know, when I first did the review, the hair was just bomb. Um, now this hair, you have to, you have to pretty much do extra to make sure that this hair doesn't like, basically start just looking too, too bad. Even though I know it's curly hair, for starters with shedding, this hair sheds like fucking crazy. Like this hair sheds horrible. So I would suggest if y'all do purchase this hair, 
please tell you guys as well because I know it's curly hair, but damn, like this hair be everywhere. I be at work and then I look, I'm like, oh my god, more hair. Like it sheds like a dog. Um, as far as the tangling, this hair it gets really tangled. That's the reason why I just basically manipulate it with my fingers versus with a comb or brush just because I feel like, I don't know, for me um, personally using this hair, I've realized that it's easier to manipulate the hair with my fingers and with water, conditioner, and a little gel versus, you know, combing it all out, then spraying it. Like I just personally feel like it makes the hair more easier to manage, I would say, just because I can just really just part it. Um, so yeah, I really don't, I do not comb this hair out or brush it out. To me, like I said, it's just easier just to manipulate it with my fingers, water, conditioner, in gel. Um, do I think that it's worth, you know, about 200 or something dollars? No. I'm going to say that just because I feel like this hair is like what you can get at the beauty supply store for like, you know, whatever amount of money. To me, this is like beauty supply hair. Now, I'm not like knocking the hair but I feel like it's not that good enough quality to be 200 and something dollars um that's just my opinion but this hair you have to really like I said this I've had a bunch of curly hair but this to me does not seem like the type of hair that is worth that much money you know what I mean like it's more beauty supply hair if you ask me the first day it was freaking gorgeous but just wearing this hair and wearing this hair I'm like I don't really think that this hair is worth the 200 and something dollars. But if y'all do decide to get this hair, I mean, you are going to have to work a little bit harder with this hair. It is pretty once you finish it, but how can I put this? This hair just tangles way too much. It sheds way too much. And like right now, see, see what this is exactly what I'm talking about. It should not be doing this. I just want to show you guys that it should not be doing this and it's nothing that I did to the hair because literally the first day that I made that video the hair was popping but then like a day or so later I'm wearing it and I'm like having to deal with like stuff like this like those tangles and it's like it, it would just mat up and I was like dang I haven't even had the hair for like a few days so like it's just this is what you have to deal with with this hair. I'm just I'm just being honest, y'all. I'm not sugarcoating anything. But overall, the hair, like I said, it's, I mean, once you do it up, it's nice. But expect it to tangle. Expect it to shake. Well, you know what? I can only say for what I got. And I was sent this hair, and this is what pretty much I received. And, you know, the hair is pretty once you really take time to do it but at the same time it's too much shedding it's too much tangling and i don't think it's worth the 200 dollars. but if y'all have purchased this hair before leave in the comments below let me know how you like this hair how you kept up with the hair um did you experience a lot of shedding and tangling with this hair like y'all okay i know this is curly hair for i know i know this but y'all i've had so when I tell y'all, I bought so much hair in my lifetime. I ain't lying. And I've had a lot of curly hair that I've dealt with. And this just reminds me so much of beauty supply hair. But I'm just I'm just putting that out there. I don't think it's worth that much, 200 some dollars. But anyways, like I said, let me know in the comments below how you guys like this hair. If y'all have tried it, um, let me know how y'all like it after I've styled it. And if y'all have any questions, just leave them below as well. And as always, I will check you guys on my next video. Bye, you guys.